In about 36 hours, the first legal recreational marijuana in Illinois will be sold. There are many questions from where you can use to what are the implications of your use in the workplace. CBS 2's Vince Girasoli hosted a Facebook Live today. To get some of those answers, here's what we learned that you need to know. Here's one sign that recreational weed sales are quickly approaching. Medical marijuana patients lined up outside this dispensary in Lakeview, in part to beat the expected rush from casual users come January 1st. We are going to see more visits to the ER. To help answer some of your last minute questions, we sat down for a Facebook Live with a panel of cannabis experts. Marijuana today is not the same marijuana that you got 10 or 20 years ago. Dr. Jenny Liu is a toxicologist with Cook County Health. She says commercial marijuana products are pure and more potent than many expect. If you're a new user, the main message would be to start small and to start slow. Emergency rooms have experienced an uptick in traffic in states where marijuana is legal. With edibles in particular, it can take hours for the effect to kick in, and users may find themselves overindulging. Overindulgence can lead to a lot of different symptoms, including nausea, vomiting, stomach pain. So you can't walk down the street just smoking a joint. The Fair Kerr is a social equity advocate in the cannabis community. She underlines the fact that cannabis use must be done in private and that landlords can place restrictions on the use. Also, though marijuana use will be legal in Illinois, your employer may have their own restrictions, and you should know those before using legal weed. Just because the state has gone legal, it's not a free-for-all to do whatever you want. We will have um, the products that are available, um, and we will have people that will be working the lines. Mike Richards from Grower Pharmacan says they anticipate long lines on January 1. They encourage consumers to check out products on websites first. Most dispensaries are bringing in extra personnel to help counsel buyers and take orders while they wait in line. He echoes the call for buyers, from potency to quantity, to be careful about how much they use. Start low, go slow. Now remember, if you purchase legal weed, it can't be consumed in a vehicle. You can't even have an open package in a vehicle, and it cannot be consumed out in public. In the city of Chicago, the violation is a $50 fee, and that bumps up to $100 for every violation that occurs within a 30-day period. But the city of Chicago says it's asking the police force to use their discretion in this transitionary period and do their best to educate the public as we make our way to a world where marijuana is legal in the state of Illinois for recreational use. Reporting live in the control room, I'm Vince Girasoli, CBS 2 News. Okay, thank you, Vince.